school. This is Mrs. Ravenolan here for our morning announcements and I'm here with my co-host Misty. She's here as part of the morning team this morning. Today is Tuesday, March 31st. I hope you had a great day of learning yesterday and are continuing to do the learning that we need to do. Please remember to log on every day and do some work. Um, we're not going to get stressed about what we can and cannot do. We're going to just do as much as we can every single day, okay? Even if there's a deadline on it, just do the best you can and hand in things as you can. All right, it's low stress for all of us. This is a difficult time and we don't want anyone having more anxiety than um, necessary, okay? So we sent out messages about an exciting thing that's gonna happen today in the town of Windsor. We are having a Windsor Public School neighborhood parade. Uh, we've developed about seven routes that are going to travel around the Windsor communities. And it starts at 12.30, um, it could be from 12.30 to 12.45 to 1 o'clock, depending where you live. Just listen for a bunch of car horns beeping, because um, we are, what we're doing is all, this, as many staff as possible are going to be coming around in a parade of cars with signs on and honking and waving. We just want to see your faces, whether you're in the window or out on your front stoop or maybe on the lawn. Just main thing is keep safe distance between everybody so that we can make sure that we're all healthy um, but we thought it would be good to see each other because even though we have to be distance apart we emotionally still are together we are a team and we're going to make sure that we stay that way so listen for the car horn and when you hear them please come out and wave um, the roots are posted on the Windsor Public School website um, we tried the best we could to hit everybody's street there may be some streets that we were not able to hit so if you could look at it and see what is close to your house, perhaps your family could walk to an area or drive in their car so that we can um, acknowledge and see you as well. And if you can't, it's okay, because um, we're gonna find other ways to stay connected. So the quote this week, we're changing our focus from leadership to kindness, because we definitely need a lot more kindness in the world. And the quote says, be somebody that makes everyone feel like somebody. That's really important because right now we're all isolated and feeling kind of alone, but we're really not. So try to do something special um, today for someone else that helps them understand that they are special as well. You know, so those are those random acts of kindness. If you see something at your house that's not right, you know, stop and pick it up, throw something away, put dishes in the dishwasher, just do something really nice for uh, the people that love and care for you. Okay. The trivia. Now, Miss Wood yesterday asked this question. What is the largest ocean on Earth? The largest ocean. I hope you did some research if you needed to, or you just made an educated guess based on what you know about oceans. The answer is Pacific Ocean. I saw some people on Google Classroom getting it right again, so it was exciting to see. Today's question is really easy, I think. I think a lot of you are gonna get it. The question is, what is the fastest land animal? The fastest land animal. Now you probably know what that is, because I think a lot of people are gonna get it, but my challenge, I'm gonna make it even harder, is how fast has that creature been recorded um, traveling? What was the fastest rate, all right? So not only do I want to name the creature, but what's the fastest that it has been uh, recorded as traveling, okay? So tomorrow, be looking for that, please. Now we're gonna go on to our uh, Kennedy commitments, our Kennedy community commitments. So remember, these are not just for our school, these are for life in general. And I'm so excited that Alex Riggs, who's a fifth grader for us, has sent a video and he will be leading the chant. So let's all repeat the Kennedy commitments along with Alex right now. Today, JFK, I will do my best to be my best. I will listen. I will follow directions. I will be honest. I will respect the rights of others. I will remember that my choices affect me and those around me. Today matters and my future is built one day at a time. Next. Uh, is a video from Mr. Ridzon, who is our new health teacher, 
He started last week. Um, unfortunately, we're not able to meet him in person, but he did make a short video to kind of introduce himself to our school community. So please welcome Mr. Ridzon. Morning, JFK. What is up? My name is Mr. Ridzon. And for some of you, I am your new health and PE teacher. In the coming weeks, I'm hoping to get to know all of you a little bit more through online learning. But for now, I wanted to share a little bit about me. Um, for one thing, I love the outdoors. I love staying active, especially in the summertime. I love going on hikes with my dog. I love pizza, who doesn't? And I am super excited to be part of your school and your community. And I can't wait to get to know all of you a little bit more in the next couple of weeks. I will be in touch. Hope you have a wonderful day. Have fun. Stay safe. Thank you, Mr. Rodson. So welcome to this uh, JFK school community. So that's it for today. Remember to have a respectful, responsible, and safe day out there. We miss you. We can't wait to the day we're together again. Bye.